I can tell you that anyone who travels through this part of Montgomery County knows how bad congestion, how bad congestion can be along Clopper Road, Route 355, uh, Quince Orchard Road, and many other thoroughfares. And we're working very hard. As we kick off this important construction project, we will be able to, we'll be delivering a much needed missing link, a new east-west route across I-270 that will improve access uh, to the Metropolitan Grove Mark train station, uh, and which will support the planned growth and the economic development in this region. I-270 is known to everyone as the technology corridor of Maryland. It's home to some of our fastest growing companies and some of our state's largest and most important job creators. With this new Watkins Mill interchange at I-270, we are making sure that Maryland will continue to be open for business. And we're also helping the citizens of Montgomery County and people from all across the state go about their daily lives in a faster, more efficient, and safer manner. The Watkins Mill interchange and the ramp connecting the two sides of Watkins Mill are both essential to the future of the city, particularly actually the ramp that connects the two sides. Right now, the main way uh, for people on one side of Gaithersburg to get to this side of Gaithersburg, you have to take uh, Montgomery Village Avenue, and it's very congested, and we see this as an as a immediate, as soon as it opens, it, we expect it to be an immediate relief on one of our most difficult intersections. So. So we're really excited, and of course, it gives us another on and off uh, for I-270. Um, you know, between 370 and Germantown Road, there's no full interchanges, and so this will be the next full interchange between that serves the area, and we think that's really important. Wow.